Fiscal Cliff, Implications for Science, presented by the American Institute of Biological Sciences Public Policy Office. Current U.S. fiscal policy is like a car on autopilot, unless the driver, in this case Congress and the President, decides to take the next exit off the highway, the car is headed for a fiscal cliff. The fiscal cliff refers to a collection of policies that will automatically go into effect in January 2013. Collectively, these policies will result in $6.8 trillion in deficit reduction, but will be achieved in a way that most economists predict will be detrimental to the economy. Although driving over the fiscal cliff will not completely destroy the car or the economy, it will cause a lot of expensive damage. Tax rates will increase for most Americans. Federal spending will be slashed due to budget sequestration. Two million jobs could be lost and the nation's fragile economic recovery could grind to a halt. Among the many sectors that could be impacted is science. All federal science agencies and programs, including the National Science Foundation, National Institutes of Health, Departments of Agriculture, Energy, and Interior, and others would be subject to an 8.2% cut in fiscal year 2013 because of sequestration. Research at the Department of Defense would be cut by 9.4%. The impact of budget sequestration could be devastating for science. These automatic budget cuts will likely cause layoffs of 31,000 scientists from government agencies and the private sector. Researchers will likely experience increased competition for a shrinking pool of grant monies. Purchasing of new equipment or renovations of federal research and national park facilities will likely be deferred. These impacts are compounded by the fact that federal investment in research and development as a share of gross domestic product has been declining for decades. Although many policymakers agree that sequestration is bad public policy that will harm the U.S. economy, lawmakers have thus far failed to take steps to fix the problem. Urge Congress and the President to act before January 2013. Take action on the AIBS Legislative Action Center at www.capwiz.com backslash AIBS.